your girl it's anna nicole welcome back to my channel if you're new here go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button so you'll be the first to know when new content is uploaded weekly so we're going to go ahead and get started with today's video today we're doing a beauty supply store haul and um, if you don't know i'm originally from dayton ohio so whenever i go home i have to go to the beauty outlet so this one is like uh unpack my ridiculous beauty supply store haul with me. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and get started. If you notice how the beauty supply store haul is, it does not come in this black bag. So to start, I'll go ahead and tell you how much I spent. Everything with tax came out to be $166.29. I don't think I've ever spent this much at the beauty supply store, but I needed a whole bunch of random things. So I got some lip glosses, beads, lashes, just a whole bunch of random stuff. So you don't get to see everything with me. So first, I got these beads. I got a couple packs of them, but they're all different. So this one, um, they are the hair beads. They're the wood mix, and they're supposed to fit up to 12 braids. So this is one pack of them. I got another pack. The wood part is different. So this one has more of the longer wood ones and then brown. And this one is more cream. And then this pack has more of all of the shorter wood ones. It's kind of bright in here because the sun is shining through the window. So hopefully, That right there was quite a bit of money because I don't know when the price of beads went up so much because I remember we could get them for super cheap, but those beads were $5.99 a pack. So, hope they look good when I do some braids. I then bought some gel. So, I got the new Eco Styler. This is the Black Caster and Avocado Oil. Supposed to be a strong hold. Um, like for all hair types, I only use Eco Styler after I wash my hair. If I want to do like a ponytail style, I don't use it as like a hold style and gel like I would do the um, Emerge brand that I've been using. But Eco Styler does do really well if you want to do ponytails. So I don't use Eco Styler. Then I got some dust seal clips for when I blow dry my hair or when I straighten it because I need something to hold it in part. I have been wanting to try the edge sticks and the, um, the hair pomade sticks. And so since I got this one, this is the Sweet Peach Scent from the Style Factory Edge Booster. And like I said, it's a pomade stick. This was $13.99. So, when I say this better be the best pomade, it smells good. It does actually smell like peaches. But I got that, and since they had the sweet peach in the pomade stick, so when you lay your wigs and like popcorn and stuff, I wanted to get the same edge control. So I got the Style Factor Edge Booster and the Sweet Peach for the style and edge control as well. And this one does not have a price on it, so. The edge control was $10.99. So, edge booster better be worth it. I then got the shining gem for the, it's the shade line for edges. I like edge controls. They usually don't work. But for the time being, I have this like an edge control on my edges instead of gel. And I have wanted to try. Like, I've been using the Miele, 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 how do you say it? Hairline of the rice water, I believe. And then I use the edge control of the honey and ginger. So instead of buying a whole new wine, I wanted to try some of them. So all of these are the pomegranate and honey. And I got the sample sizes. I like getting the sample sizes before buying a whole wine to make sure I like it. So I got the leave in conditioner. So I'll use this when I do a twist out and I'm gonna do mini twist. I have the coil sculpting custard. I'll use this if I'm doing more like a wash and go. And then I got 
got to twist this this way. And once again, if I want to do this twist, I can use this. So I got three things from the Miele Pomegranate and Honey line. I wanted to try to test this instead of buying a whole full size. If I don't like it, I'll be upset. If I get the full size, then I usually end up wasting it. Now, I had planned on straightening my hair while I was home, but I didn't get around to it. But I got the heat protector, and this is the Tai Chi Black Blow Dry and Flat Iron Thermal Shield. You can get this from pretty much anywhere. This light is so bright. I don't think you can see it. If you can't see the products, I'll upload pictures at the end because, like I said, the light is really bright. It's like 3 o'clock in the afternoon, so the sun is perfect. I cannot, cannot, cannot get any oil better than this. So I got the Jamaican mango in lime, and it's the pure Jamaican black castor and argan oil. And I use this when I run out of the As I Am um, Jamaican black castor water spray, and I make my own with this. And then it's also super thick, so if I'm doing a twist out, I can rub it on my hands and it makes it less freaky when I take it down. Oh, and I got the curl smoothie from the Miele pomegranate and honey wine. So I must have really wanted to try the pomegranate and honey wine. I hope I like it. I got some Salon Pro Jamaican Black Castor Oil Formula with, uh, I don't know why I stuttered, like I don't say this all the time, jojoba oil. And it's the hair food, hair scalp nourishment. And I think I got this for my mom because she likes to mix oils and she always gets mad at me when I take her oils back to recipe. Then I got my mom this oil as well. I thought I got another one, but I might do my pass. So this is just once again home home oil. And it's the super thin one there. Yeah, this is $1.99, so she usually makes these because they're thinner, and she doesn't like as thick of oils on her hair, so she likes those ones. Yep, and then this is the avocado oil from the same brand, the Via Natural Ultra Care. And I got some mousse because I wanted to try this on mousse. I have never used this one, so I hope I like it. It is the African Pride Moisture Miracle Rose Water and Argon Oil, and it's supposed to be for curls. So usually mousses, like, sometimes they make your hair crunchy, and I don't like that. And so I wanted to try this one to see if it actually, like, smooths it and makes it less crazy from when I do, like, a more simple curl. Then, I needed some rubber bands because I do, like, a lot of mini braids and mini tricks, and sometimes I'll keep them in the front of my hair, and then I'll add these. So I needed some rubber bands. These are just a simple 500 pack. You can never have too many rubber bands, because every time I can't find any when I need them. And I got some lip glosses. I got the two of the Broadway band, and that's the Broadway band. Broadway brand, and that's the brand I have on in this video. So I already have on the mint oil, but I got a new one, and then I got the mango butter. I think I like the mango butter better than the mint one, but I like both of them. I got them, and they're super cheap because I always love lip glosses, so I don't spend a lot of money on that. Oh, and then this one, I don't want to show it because. It's been so it's been sold out because everybody had found out about it, but it is the best lip gloss hands down. It's the Ruby Kiss um, by Kiss, and it's the hydrating lip oil, and it is glossy, but it also makes your lips soft. So this one is my go-to lip gloss. And like I said, as soon as everybody found out about it on Instagram and YouTube, it was sold out. So if you go get it, don't buy like a lot because I do like it, but. It is the best one. Then I wanted to get some lashes. So I had to get some lash glue. I wanted to get the lash glue that's like the hair glue, but it was at the front of the register. And by the time I was checking out, there was a huge line behind me. So I didn't want to be like, hey, can I have this um, lash glue? So I just got this one. It is the Absolute Loop for individual eyelash adhesive. And this one is the clear one. 
then I got Thank you for watching my video and I hope to see you again soon.